Thank you for buying this 14604 clear cabinet from fixturedisplays.com. You can find this product by going to our website and search 14604. In this video, we're going to show you step by step instructions to make sure you can assemble this correctly and quickly. These are all the components you have the back panel the uh, left and right, the bottom, the top, the shelf, and the front door panel along with LED strips, hardware, and glue strips. If you have any questions, email us cs at fixturedisplays.com. First, you want to pick out the back panel and the side panel. Observe the bottom section have black screen printed on them to create a false bottom to give the unit certain elevation and also hide the electrical components underneath. Identify the left and right and make sure the counter sinkhole position is facing outside and fasten with the screws. Likewise, to the right hand side panel. If you have any questions, email us cs at fixturedisplays.com. Now we're going to install the bottom. Make sure the guide tube are facing down or out. There are two screws to fasten at this moment. This is the time um, to put the glue strips on. You can certainly also do so before you assemble the set panel altogether. Measure your products and make sure uh, you have your dimension correctly calculated. Measure twice and glue once. In this particular case, we're randomly selecting a 5 inch distance to position the left hand side glue strip. And make sure you do this carefully and slowly so that they are even. Now, the glue is fairly aggressive. However, glue have two enemies, either very hot or very cold temperatures. If you foresee you are going to use them in those conditions, you should consider purchasing acrylic glue and proper applicators to glue them instead of using the glue strips. We also sell those products. Feel free to inquire with us and the part number is 11310 on our website. Now we're going to install the front panel. They fit right in and fasten with screws on two sides. To care and clean this unit, the best thing to use is rubbing alcohol. They clean it really well and leave no residue. Now we're going to fasten the two screws uh, between the bottom panel and the door panel. Now we only have the top panel to install. When you were installing the shelf, observe there is a notch position. The notch should face the back side so that the LED tubes can be in inserted later on. That is now. There's no left or right, just make sure the cord is organized properly. Slide them in and fasten with two set screws. Really gently, you don't have to do that very hard. Just enough to hold it. And then you want to organize the wire by tying it up to keep it neat and untangled. Now we're going to turn on the power to show you the LED light effect. And this is how it functions. 
the LED strips are optional install. You don't have to install them. Uh, if you desire different effects, you can contact us cs at fixturedisplays.com. That's cs at fixturedisplays.com. We're going to give you some dimensions of this unit. It's 16 inches left to right, 8 inches front to back, and 20 inches tall. It weighs right about 9 pounds. If you purchase multiple units, the keys are going to work for all of them. If you have a special need for the keys, do contact us. If you lost your key, contact us. We can point you out where to purchase the lock assembly along with the two keys. If you like our product, we can really use a good review. Now we're putting on a spinner so you can see the all three sides, front and back, a three-dimensional view, either before or after your purchase. We encourage you to look at the video even before you made your purchase commitment so that you make uh, very informed purchasing decisions. If you like this video, we uh, encourage you to share this among your social network and share the link of our product in on our website. Thank you for shopping Fixture Displays.